Hey guys and welcome back to my uh, I'm over here like hey guys <laughs> Hey guys and welcome back to my channel I'm so excited that you guys are here today Because we have big news Thank you so much for 1,000 subscribers I, I mean I think I just checked And it's like 1,100 right now And I just can't Express my gratitude enough For this I, I'm speechless And very little in my life do I have little to say so thank you so much. I really appreciate it. But I really wanted to get on here and tell you guys, one, why I love Julian the Phantom so much, and two, just about, like, what's what's to come with my channel, you know, so that you guys can tell your friends. Thank you. With Julian the Phantom, tell your friends. See what I did there? Tell your friends. <clears throat> so anyways, uh, <laughs> um, yeah, so Julian the Phantom's for me, it's not really, like, a fangirl thing. You know how everyone's like, oh my gosh, I love Luke. I love Reggie. I love Alex. Maddie. Like, I love the characters, yes, but I'm not like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna marry Luke. I'm more so like, I'm in love with the show. I love how, I just love the show so much. The way that they set it up, and I know it's from an original version, but it's really, they really did something for this to modernize it for our generation. Like, I feel like the show has brought a lot of music back into people's lives, and in a, in a year like 2020, we need something that was feel good, that was family for everyone, all age brackets. There's no limitations. This isn't a kid's show. I think I saw an interview one time where in the comments they were like, even though it's a kid's show, and I was like, kid's show? I'll be 21 this month. What are you talking about? Like, I've watched it 17 times. Not That's not true, but it probably is. I've lost count. So my point to that is, Julian the Phantoms is really a show where you can just rock out. I mean, the slogan is perfect. You know, you only live once, but you can rock forever. That's so true. And I'm the kind of person that looks at my life as like an optimistic outlook in any situation. It could be the cloudiest of days, and I will find a way to push through the sunshine. So, I mean, with a year like 2020, with everybody watching, I mean, everyone's experienced this year so differently. And to know that we can come together as phantoms and just kind of talk about a show that we love and theories that we think are going to happen on season two and what direction we hope to see it in is just so amazing. And I'm so glad that y'all trust me as a spokesperson, I guess, to kind of express that love and express your ideas from the comments to my YouTube page. So thank you so much for being in invested in it as much as I am. But I just wanted to come on here real quick and just say thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Um, 1100 strong. I really appreciate it. Um, keep telling your friends and I will keep making videos for as long as my love lives for Julian the Phantoms um, with hopes of, you know, probably being in season two or three. We're going to pray on it. We're going to hope on it. I'm currently taking electric guitar lessons. I'm about to start learning the drums. I'm constantly with my singing coach. It's just a lot going on. They, Julian the Phantoms really brought music back into my life and I haven't been happier this year than for when I saw Julian the Phantoms. So thank you, Kenny Ortega, David, uh, uh, David Cross, Dan Hodge. If I mixed up the names, I'm so sorry. Like everybody that worked on that production, I'm following everyone. Tori, the choreographer, um, Paul Becker, please check out his channel. I'm going to link it in the description below, but he posts all the behind the scenes footage and it's just absolutely amazing. Next video that's coming this weekend. So stay tuned. I also have a new series coming out too. Um, involving TikTok and some of your favorite creators. So make sure that you guys subscribe to know what that new series drops. I'm planning to maybe drop a little teaser video tonight, but the new series will definitely be out by next Friday. So make sure that you're subscribed and you tell your friends. Oh, I'm going to leave you guys on a reenactment I did of Julian the Phantoms. I will probably be doing these at the end of every video from now on because I love it and I've memorized their lines. So without further ado, peace. Oh my gosh, how did you do that? Well, clearly you're not understanding. Clearly she doesn't get it. Okay, look, we're ghosts, right? We're just three ghosts, and we're really happy to be home. So thank you for the flowers. They really brighten up the room. We're actually in a band called Sunset Curve. Tell your friends. Last night was supposed to be a really big night for us. It was going to change our lives. I'm, uh, I'm pretty sure it did. Is this freaking me out? <gasps> what is that? What are you doing? It's my phone. No. Nope. Nope. Stop, Stop talking, talking to them. them. They, they aren't are real. There's no such thing as cute ghosts. <laughs> Think we're cute? Who are you calling? I'm, I'm Googling Sunset, Sunset Swerve. Sunset, Sunset Curve. Get ready to rock out!